my name is Corey Ashton and welcome to another WordPress Wednesday. Have you noticed that your WordPress website by default, every time you upload an image into your media library, it creates an actual random page that lives there with your picture sitting on it. It actually calls your header and your footer and your sidebars if there are those happening and just puts the picture on there. These pages just kind of naturally live there. So you can imagine if you have spent time loading in 10 images, 30 images, 300 images, you have 300 extra pages living underneath your WordPress dashboard. I'm going to show you exactly what I'm talking about. And I'm going to show you the fix for it all in the budget of free. Shout out to Nexus who has the best hosting that there is. If you are running a WordPress website, which I'm assuming you are because you're checking out my channel, be sure to reach out to them if you need great support, especially if you're running e-commerce, WooCommerce inside the WordPress world. All right, let's go take a look at this great quick fix. I'll show you what this looks like inside your media library. Coming over here, if you were to see one of these great little pictures here inside of your media library, if you go right here to view attachment page, click on that. That's where it'll kick you out and let you see. So this is an actual page that lives on my website and, and will be indexed by Google on my website. There's just zero SEO value and it really muddies and weighs down your website. No reason for it. So let me show you the fix for it. It is Yoast, which is a free plugin, they have a premium version, but um, this is able to be fixed by the free version of Yoast. If you want to learn more about it, they have a really great article over here. I will put the link to this in the description box below. It gives you a little bit more background of the why this is happening on your WordPress website. And again, kind of that step-by-step -step process of walking through the fix. But I'm going to show you right now how to do that. Let's jump into your dashboard. You're going to want to go ahead and get in your plugins area and add Yoast if you haven't already. That's the plan right now. So let's jump in here and look for Yoast. It's like toast, but with a Y. In my opinion, it's by far the best SEO plugin there is in the WordPress world. Five million plus active installs. Gotta tell you something there. We're gonna go ahead and click install now and activate. Once that's done on the left side over here, you have the SEO tab. We're gonna go ahead and go into search appearance. Click there. Notice the tabs up at the top now. I want you to go into media and see this right here. This says, we recommend you set this to yes. So redirect the attachment URLs to the attachment itself. So by default, that's how Yoast comes activated. So as soon as you do that, you've actually solved the problem. But if you're running your WordPress website and you're going right now into your media library and you're checking to see if this is actually a problem for you, you're coming here and you're clicking the view attachment page and you're actually starting to see a page render, that's a problem. What you want to see is what just happened now because I just installed Yoast. It now goes directly to the image URL instead of a page. So that is exactly what you want to do and they've solved that for us. Okay, so this is really just best practices for you. Be certain every website you ever create inside the WordPress world is running Yoast because you saw just literally by activating that plugin, it automatically did best practices for me and eliminated that code that calls those pages to exist. Ah, kind of cool, huh y'all? All right. I hope you're having a great one. If you run Yoast and you're curious about how to make it even more optimized and use it to the best ability possible for search engine rank, I have an entire playlist here on my channel that you can check out. I'll put the link to that in the description box below. Be sure to hang out with me every single Wednesday. Click like and subscribe. I'm right back here next week giving you more tips on how to improve your online marketing inside the world of WordPress. Have a great one, y'all. See you next time. Stay safe. Thank you.